안녕하십니까? 2016학년도 2월 고등학교 2학년 전국연합학력평가 영어 영역 듣기 및 말하기 평가 안내방송입니다. 잠시 후 2016학년도 2월 고등학교 2학년 전국연합학력평가 3교시 영어 영역 듣기 및 말하기 평가 방송을 시작하겠습니다. 수험생 여러분은 편안한 마음으로 방송에 귀를 기울여 주시고 방송 담당 선생님께서는 스피커의 음량을 알맞게 조절해 주십시오. 수험생 여러분은 답안을 작성하기 전에 반드시 답안지 왼쪽 해당란에 성명, 수험번호 등을 정확하게 기입하고 표기하였는지 확인하기 바랍니다. 듣기 및 말하기 평가 문제는 1번부터 17번까지입니다. 방송을 잘 듣고 문제지에 있는 다섯 개의 답지 중에서 맞는 답 하나만 골라 답안지의 해당란에 바르게 표기하십시오. 그러면 지금부터 3교시 영어 영역 듣기 및 말하기 평가를 시작하겠습니다. 1번부터 17번까지는 듣고 답하는 문제입니다. 1번부터 15번까지는 한 번만 들려주고 16번부터 17번까지는 두번 들려줍니다. 방송을 잘 듣고 답을 하기 바랍니다. 1번 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Jane, are you done with the novel? Yes, I read the whole book in just two days. It was really interesting. I want to read that book too. Can I borrow it from you? 2번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Kevin, you look tired. Are you okay? I didn't get enough sleep last night. I watched baseball on TV until 2 a.m. Oh, I didn't know you liked baseball that much. 3번. 다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Good morning, students. This is an announcement from the student council. These days, excessive food waste has become a problem in our school. Our school is spending a huge amount of money getting rid of this waste. So, from September to December, The Student Council will conduct a campaign to reduce food waste in our school cafeteria and make every Wednesday No Leftovers Day. Through this campaign, we expect to cut costs and will donate the money saved to a charity. All students, please keep in mind, our small steps can make a big difference. We need your support and participation in our No Leftovers Day campaign. Thank you. 4번 대화를 듣고 남자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hey, Jake. How have you been? I've been very busy these days, working a part-time job and learning Spanish. Learning Spanish? Why? I'm going to Madrid this summer. Sounds exciting. Do you speak any Spanish? Not really, so I'm learning a little now. Do you have time to study Spanish? I'm taking an online course. 
it saves both time and money. Don't you think just doing online classes is boring? Well, some people might think so, but I think online classes have advantages. Like what? I can do the lessons whenever I want to and wherever I am. Besides, I can review them over and over again. That makes sense. It'll surely help your learning. O Bun. Pay what it did go. Two Sarame Gwangere, Kajang Tal Latan and Gosil Kurushio. Excuse me. Coffee is not allowed here, sir. Oh, I'm sorry. Where should I put it away? You can just give it to me. Thank you. Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for the English novel section. Oh, it's over there. Would you follow me? Here we are. Can you also help me find a book? It's Hemingway's Old Man and the Sea. Hemingway? Hmm. Here it is. Good. And is it okay to return it if I find printing mistakes? It's happened before. Of course. According to our return and refund policy, the book must be returned within a week with your receipt. I see. Thanks a lot for your help. 6번. 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. How was the magic show last night? Fantastic. Let me show you a picture. The man wearing the hat must be the magician. Right. Look at the bird sitting on the branch. At the start of the show, the bird came out of the magician's hat. Wonderful. And who is the lady with glasses on next to the magician? She was a member of the audience. What did she do? She made sure that the box was empty and put it on the table. That box on the table? Yes. Unbelievably, the magician pulled flowers out of the box. That's why the flowers are on the floor. Wow, it must have been awesome. Absolutely. I couldn't take my eyes off of the stage. 7번 대화를 듣고 남자가 할 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Dad, do you know mom's birthday is tomorrow? Of course. How could I forget? I thought you had forgotten about it. Come on. I'm thinking of throwing her a birthday party. How sweet. I have a good idea. Let's hide in the dark and jump out to surprise her when she gets home from work. Sounds fun. Why don't you work out a plan to give her a nice surprise? No problem. I'll take care of it. Dad, How about inviting Aunt Maria and Aunt Liz? Sure. And don't forget to decorate the living room with colorful balloons and flowers. Okay. Dad, we also need to buy a birthday cake. You know Mom loves cake. Don't worry. I've already ordered one. I'll go get it now. 8번. 대화를 듣고 여자가 뉴욕에 가려는 이유를 고르시오. Amy, what's with all the clothes and bags? Oh, I need to pack some things to go to New York. New York? How come? Well, the Modern Art Gallery in New York is going to exhibit my paintings next month. Really? Congratulations! This is the opportunity you've been waiting for. Thanks. I'm so excited.
A lot of visitors will come and see my paintings. Good for you. How did you get the chance? Last month, I sent my portfolio to that gallery. And? I got an invitation letter from them this morning. They sent me a plane ticket, too. Your efforts are finally paying off. I'm looking forward to being there for the opening. Can I help you? I need t-shirts and caps for my school sports day. We have different types of shirts and caps. Please take your time and look around. Hmm, do you have t-shirts under $15? Sure. How about this blue one? It's only $10. Sounds good. How much is that red cap on the shelf? It's five dollars. How many shirts and caps do you need? Twenty t-shirts and twenty caps. If you're buying that many, I can give you a ten percent discount off the total price. That's great. Do you offer lettering on t-shirts like Way to Go? Yes, we offer lettering to students for free. Awesome. Here's my student ID card. I'll pay in cash. Okay. 10번 대화를 듣고 스킨 프로블럼에 관해 두 사람이 언급하지 않은 것을 고르시오. Good morning. What can I do for you? I have a skin problem on my back. Can you describe it for me? My back was itchy all night. I scratched it and now I have small red dots all over it. When did it start? Yesterday evening. I couldn't sleep at all last night. Did you eat or do anything different recently? These problems often happen when people change something in their routine. I guess it could be an allergic reaction to a new soap. Then I recommend this anti-itching cream. Okay, but what if it doesn't work? In that case, you should see a doctor. It's probably nothing serious, but better safe than sorry. Right. Thank you. 11번 로스빌 피트니스 클럽에 관한 다음 내용을 듣고 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Hello, this is Roseville Fitness Club. Come and enjoy our latest promotion. Our fitness club offers fantastic benefits to new members. You can get a 50% discount for your first month. Plus, you can use lockers for free. Our various programs include swimming, yoga, Latin dance classes, as well as weight training. Our personal trainers and up-to-date equipment will help you to stay healthy. Our club is open every day from 6 a.m. until 10 p.m. We also have a cafe with a variety of sports drinks and fruit juices for your refreshment needs. Please visit us. and sign up for your club membership today. Thank you. 12번 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 남자와 여자가 구매하기로 선택한 티켓을 고르시오. Wow. We're finally in Sydney. Where should we go? I just picked up this city tour leaflet. Take a look. How about this 24-hour ticket? It provides unlimited bus rides for 24 hours. But we're staying here for three days. 
Isn't it better to buy a 48 hour ticket instead? That makes sense. Do we need an audio guide? Of course. It'll definitely help us get to know more about Sydney's attractions. Okay. How about the Sydney Harbor Cruise? Let me see. Don't you think spending $130 is too much for a city tour? Yeah. If we save some money on this, we can visit a museum later. Then let's take the one without the cruise. Good. Let's go. Good morning. Where are you heading, ma'am? Would you take me to the Empire State Building? Okay. Fasten your seat belt, please. I have an important presentation. Can you go a little faster? Sorry, if I go any faster, I might get a speeding ticket. Don't you know any shortcuts? This is the best route, ma'am. Then I can't help it. I should have left home earlier. Oh my, there's heavy traffic up ahead. Yes, I see. It's bumper to bumper. What's going on? You see? Over there, they're doing road repairs. What bad luck! And we're only three blocks away. Oh no! The forecast says there will be snowstorms next week. What should we do about our trip? Let's leave as we planned. The problem is, we don't have any snow tires. We should have bought some last year when snow tires were on sale. But it was spring then, so we didn't need any. Anyway, it's dangerous to take a trip without snow tires. You're right. If we're not careful, accidents can happen. Now we have to find a shop that sells inexpensive snow tires. Wait, don't you remember that internet store for winter goods? We saw it together. 15번. 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 피터가 낸시에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Nancy is getting married to Peter next month. Because she works as a fashion designer, Nancy is making a beautiful wedding dress for herself on her own. She cut the dress pattern, picked out white silk fabric, and sewed every piece of cloth together very carefully. Everything seemed to be all right. Then, Nancy decided to add one more touch to her dress, a bead decoration. However, while decorating the dress with hundreds of beads, she has become tired and stressed out. Now, Peter is worried about Nancy because she doesn't look happy. So, he's trying to persuade her to look for someone who can do it with her. In this situation, What would Peter most likely say to Nancy? Nancy. 16번부터 17번까지는 두번 들려줍니다. 16번과 17번. 다음을 듣고 물음에 답하시오. Hello, students. Have you ever felt frustrated when you want to get good grades but don't know what to do? Today, I'm going to tell you a few things to help you with your study. 
First of all, you should use a study planner. It should include your study schedules and learning goals. It'll be helpful to draw up a timetable and you should revise it when necessary. Another thing to consider is creating your own notebook. Write notes using charts, graphs, and mind maps so that you can memorize the information systematically. Next, Read your textbook until you can thoroughly understand what it says. What you need to know about a subject is in the textbook, and it's the best basic material for studying. Lastly, make sure you won't be disturbed by anything while you're studying. For example, smartphones are the biggest distraction to your studies. Just turn off your phone when you study. Good luck. 다시 한번 듣겠습니다. Hello, students. Have you ever felt frustrated when you want to get good grades but don't know what to do? Today, I'm going to tell you a few things to help you with your study. First of all, you should use a study planner. It should include your study schedules and learning goals. It'll be helpful to draw up a timetable and you should revise it when necessary. Another thing to consider is creating your own notebook. Write notes using charts, graphs, and mind maps so that you can memorize the information systematically. Next, read your textbook until you can thoroughly understand what it says. What you need to know about a subject is in the textbook, and it's the best basic material for studying. Lastly, make sure you won't be disturbed by anything while you're studying. For example, smartphones are the biggest distraction to your studies. Just turn off your phone when you study. Good luck! 16번 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것은 17번. 언급된 물건이 아닌 것은? 이제 듣기 및 말하기 문제가 끝났습니다. 18번부터는 문제지의 지시에 따라 답을 하기 바랍니다.